Hello and welcome to the session. My name is Mansi and I'm going to help you with the following question. The question says find the derivative of the following function from first principle and that is x plus 1 divided by x minus 1. So let us start with the solution to this question. First of all we see that according to first principle f dash x is equal to limit h approaching to 0 function at x plus h minus function at x divided by h. So in order to find out f dash x we have to find fx that is given to us is x plus 1 divided by x minus 1. Function at x plus h we can get by simply replacing x by x plus h that will be x plus h plus 1 divided by x plus h minus 1. So now we can say that f dash x is equal to limit h approaching to 0 function at x plus h is x plus h plus 1 divided by x plus h minus 1 minus function at x that is x plus 1 divided by x minus 1 the whole divided by h. Now let us simplify it further. This is equal to limit h approaching to 0 x plus h minus 1 into x minus 1. Now we are subtracting these two. Here we will have x plus h plus 1 into x minus 1 minus x plus h minus 1 into x plus 1. This divided by h. This is equal to limit h approaching to 0. Now let us open the brackets. We will have x square minus x plus hx minus h plus x minus 1 minus x square plus x plus hx plus h minus x minus 1 divided by h into x minus 1 into x plus h minus 1. Now this is equal to limit h approaching to 0. Now x square gets cancelled with minus x square. So we will have minus x minus x is minus 2x plus hx will get cancelled with minus hx. Minus h minus h is minus 2h plus x minus of minus x is plus so plus 2x minus 1 plus 1 they get cancelled divided by h into x minus 1 into x plus h minus 1. Now we see that minus 2x gets cancelled with plus 2x. And we have limit h approaching to 0 minus 2h divided by h into x minus 1 into x plus h minus 1. We see that h gets cancelled with h and we have limit h approaching to 0 minus 2 divided by x minus 1 into x plus h minus 1. Now applying the limit that is putting h equal to 0 we will have minus 2 divided by x minus 1 into x minus 1 that is equal to minus 2 by x minus 1 the whole square. So our answer to this question is minus 2 divided by x minus 1 the whole square. I hope that you understood the question and enjoyed the session. Have a good day.